Dude, up. And now he's going to be here at 8 o'clock. Oh, he's going to be here at 8 o'clock. And the hand said, I'm going to beat you, Tortoise. I'm going to beat you. And everybody in town says, Go, Tortoise, go. Go, Tortoise. But they'd be sitting there drinking water. And they're going, We know the Tortoise is going to lose. We know he's going to lose. But we're going to cheer for him anyway. Because the hand always wins and he's so obnoxious. <laughs> So that morning came. Everybody was on the street. Everywhere. There were turtles. There were crows. There were snakes. There were elephants. There were tigers and bears. Ha ha he he. Everywhere. And they were rooting for guess who? The turtles. The turtle. Because he never won. And the hair was always begging how good he was. So here comes the day of the race. And here's the starting line. The tortoise was there. Here I am, everybody cheering him on. He goes, you know, I won't win, but hey, I got to show up for the race. And, his, and it was the starter. It was the penguin. Hi, okay, guys, you ready? Where's the hair? It doesn't matter. It's 8 o'clock. It's time to start. On your mark. Tortoise goes, well, maybe I'll win this race. The hair ain't here. Get set. Here comes the hair. Go! And he started on down the road. And the tortoise went. Go, tortoise, go faster! I'm going as fast as I can go. Go faster, tortoise, go faster, tortoise! And the hair goes, where is everybody? Where is everybody? He's not even coming. And he found this place where he could go get some drinks and just relax. And so he went in to get some drinks. He started drinking and he bought he bought himself some some sandwiches and started eating and tortoises killed do 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 and the hand is sitting there drinking and eating these sandwiches and watching TV and football on the air on the on the on the TV <laughs> and the tortoise comes along and he passes the restaurant where the hair was and he just keeps coming pretty soon he saw in his vision the finish line and the hare still back there drinking and he's eating and he's having a good time and watching football and he forgot all about the race. And he forgot all about the race. He totally forgot. <laughs> and here's, here's the hare. He's coming to the finish line. And the hare goes, Oh, I forgot. What about the race? And he starts, he sees the finish line. He sees the tortoise about to cross the finish line. The tortoise goes, He's about to reach for the finish line. And here comes the hare. <laughs> and the tortoise won the race. And everybody cheered, yeah, yeah. And the hare went, well, if I don't want the football game, I don't want the race. And said, you got beat. You got beat. You know you got beat. The tortoise goes, thank you, everybody. Thank you for cheering for me. And they hold him up in the air, you know, and he, he poops all over everybody. <laughs> that's, what, that's what turtles do when you hold them up, you know. <laughs> Once we had a tortoise, and, and once I picked it up and it peed on me. Yeah. <laughs> I picked up a frog and it peed all over So the moral of the story is, even though you don't think you can win, try your hardest. Because you might. Don't ever let everybody say you can't win. If it's a singing contest, or a play in the piano contest, or it's an artist contest, or it's a whatever contest, don't worry about it. Just do your best, because you might win. You might win. Do your best. So the moral of the story is always do what? Your best. Do your best. What is it? Uh, always do what? Josiah. Yeah. Josiah. <laughs> what is it, yes. Josiah? What? Always do your best. Yes. What about you? Always do your best. What about you, Livy? I don't know. Always do your best. <laughs> what about you, Ryan? <laughs> what? Good question. Always do your best. What about you, Ike? <laughs> okay, so everybody, a round of kisses for everybody. We start off with the big Okay, I guess.